Hello students, you are very welcome to the geography classes of social science class 10. This is class 10 social science geography. It is my first virtual class for you. In your school classes, our syllabus is more than 50% has already completed. There are four lessons where we have completed two lesson, lessons and third lesson that is geography of the world was going on. I have completed in this part about the brief introduction of the art, distribution of the continents and oceans where we have discussed about the continental deep theory by Alfred Wegener and now I am going to discuss about the distribution and characteristics of the ocean. Here we have to discuss the oceans which are present in our earth surface. I have already discussed in your school classes about the bottom configuration of the ocean floor where I have already discussed about the coastline, coastal region uh, continental shelf, continental slope, deep sea plain or a cell plain different ocean transits all about this I have already discussed in your school class. Now, I am going to discuss about the oceans which are present in our earth. It's an every oceans are very important, particularly Pacific Ocean, Indian Ocean, and Atlantic Ocean. These three oceans are very important for your exam. At the very beginning, I am going to start about the Pacific Ocean, which we have, most of you have know about this Pacific Ocean. It is the largest ocean in the world. World largest ocean is this Pacific Ocean. It covers one third of the earth total areas. You just imagine how much large this ocean is. You divide three regions, whole art, you can divide three equal region of the art and this one region among the three is the Pacific Ocean in our art. It is the largest ocean in the world. Its area is how much? 165 million square kilometer. 165 million square kilometer. Very large ocean. And the depth of the Pacific Ocean is nearly about 5,000 meter. Its average depth is 5,000 meter. Where is the Pacific Ocean now? You see, this is the Pacific Ocean. This one and this. There are two parts are given here. Why? Because Earth is round. This part and that part is connecting with the sun. 
So here is shown in two part in this map. It is the largest ocean and secondly the boundary of the ocean is very important. What is the boundary of Pacific Ocean? In the north, north of Pacific Ocean, what is it? In the north of Pacific Ocean is here Bering Strait. Here is Bering Strait you see now. In this boat region it is given. It is Alaska, northern part of USA. Alaska and this is the part of Asia which is known as, within Russia which is known as Siberia. So in the north we have found a Bering Strait or you can say Bering Sea, Alaska and part of Siberia in the north. And now, uh, eastern part of the Pacific Ocean, in the eastern direction, it is North America, the continent North America and South America, in the eastern part. And in the western direction of the, of the ocean, that is, it is Asia the continent Asia and the continent Oceania including Australia. Hmm? In the west Asia and Oceania is found. But in south, what is it? South of the Pacific Ocean in the southern part and this is the southern part. Southern part, there is an ocean which is known as Southern Ocean. In the south, Southern Ocean is located. Okay, it is the boundary of the Pacific Ocean. Now, you see, there are more than 20,000 more than 20,000 islands are present in this Pacific Ocean. What are those? The important islands of the Pacific Oceans are Japan. Where it is? In the western direction of Pacific Ocean, northwestern direction of Pacific Ocean, it is the Japan Island and it is a part of the continent Asia. Next is Taiwan. It is also in the western part. Taiwan, this is uh, Taiwan. Taiwan is located here in this region. And Philippines. Philippines is also a group of islands which is found in this region, in the western part. Next is New Zealand. At the south of the country, uh, Asia, that is New Zealand. It is the New Zealand. And Indonesia. It is Indonesian islands, Java, Sumatra. All these are found here. Hmm? And next important one is Hawaiian Island, which is very famous for tourist attraction. Hawaiian Island. It is a volcanic island. It is formed by volcano, and active volcanoes are also present at that time. So these are some important islands which are found in this Pacific Ocean. Next is some important marine trenches. Trench you know? 
द डीपेस्ट पार्ट ऑफ द ओशन ट्रेंस इज द डीपेस्ट पार्ट ऑफ द ओशन एंड यू हैव ऑलरेडी हार्ड दैट अबाउट द मेरियाना ट्रेंस मेरियाना ट्रेंस हुई इज लोकेटेड इन दिस स्पेसिफिक ओशन मेरियाना ट्रेंस इट इज द डीपेस्ट ट्रेंस ऑफ द वर्ल्ड it is nearly 11 km depth from sea level just to imagine it how much depth it is 11 km depth it is located in the southern part of japan hmm southern part of japan the mariana trench is located southern part of japan and other important trenches are elusian trench kurai trench philippine trench tanga trench peru sili trench etc these are some important trenches found in this uh, pacific ocean lots of ocean trenches are present in this ocean and you see the pacific ocean is also deepest ocean in the world its average depth is 5000 meter 5000 meter depth found in this ocean next there are lots of seas bays and gulf are present around this pacific ocean lots of sea bay gulf are huh? this type of small seas are found all around this pacific ocean what are those they are bering sea this is nearby bering strait bering sea next is okhotok sea okhotok sea is found here in this region there is an island okhotok and very near of this island the okhotok sea is found there and japan sea is very near to japan and philippine sea is found in philippine islands and another important sea is also found here in the in the northern part of pacific ocean which is known as gulf of alaska or sea of alaska okay this is all about uh the pacific ocean there are lots of short questions are present here such as which is the largest ocean in the world what's its area what is average depth and and name two islands which are located in the western border of pacific ocean uh next name sea or bay which is located in the northern part of uh, pacific ocean Hmm? This way, there are lots of objective questions are present here. Its area, uh, uh, important transits, hmm? all these are very important. And there is another important question is a, uh, it is long question that is near about five marks. Question is that give a brief geographical description. about the uh pacific ocean here you have to write from location area depth boundaries number of trenches and islands and uh, number of seas and gulf present in this ocean you have to write in details all about that in the in that long question 
Okay? This is about passive equation. So, I will continue next with Indian Ocean in my next class. And another important thing is that the continents which are found in this lesson, in this continents which are found in this lesson, it is taught by our adaptation from the next classes. Hmm? About the continents, Asia, Europe, North America, South America, Oceania, Antarctica, all about that. Okay? So this much is enough for this class. I will continue next by Indian Ocean. Thank you.